Ken Bastida with news about a very pricey fixer upper. Ken? Yeah, well, it's. It's cute. The home is on Waverly Street in Palo Alto. The listing describes it as an architectural gem from a past charming era. But boy, oh boy, history can be expensive. The home built almost a century ago sits on a 10,000 square foot lot. The insides need a lot of work. But this decaying old structure in the heart of Silicon Valley could be your dream home. It's up for sale for just $5 million. I would say worth every penny, right? It's not um, an outrageous price. It's a, it's a price one would expect. Miles McCormick works in residential real estate. He says for those who can afford to live here, this home is ripe for the picking. There's so much money in town, and there's not a lot of need for mortgage. Most d transactions I handle are all cash. He says if wealthy tech lords don't swoop in, then spec builders could snap it up. And they have paid close to five million, if not more, for a lot this size, even smaller. And a brand new house with all the bells and whistles could double the investment. There are comps to support easily 10 million. Easily. The home is located in a prime location on a tree-lined street close to Stanford University and within walking distance of the downtown. I like the rustic antique feel. Nunley Rawson from Atlanta, Georgia would love to buy it, but only if she had the money. There's always room for improvement, right? <laughs> I keep thinking about people in Arkansas, guys, you know, places like uh, Alabama wow. who are looking at this going, yeah. Oh my goodness. What? 10 million? Oh While most people would probably tear the home down, McCormick says roughly 25% would try to restore at least some of it, and he doesn't see any slowing in the market. Snap it up now, Veronica. Ouch. Next year it's going to be 20 million. Oh, all right. I'm on it. Thanks.